Hello and welcome to Monkey News, the number one sh news channel for Ball Banana Needs. Another bright day shines on the UMG today, and we will be covering great stories of UMG heroes. First, the pro UMG leader Singa, who had who had the speech last night talking about how much he simply loves our great country. Today we gather here to recognize this fate our country has led to. Today we gather around in sanctity to hopefully agree in unity that these forces are making our country a much great place and that we, wa we will stand for it and we will give them a big hug. Instead, we must take this power, give them more power, to give it to each other to ensure only the best for not just the monkey elites, but for all monkey kind. I say yes. And also, I have a small penis, and uh, the, uh, the, the, the president have, has a much bigger penis than I do. And while inspiring speeches like these highlight the core strength of our country, some still refuse to allow it to be the case. Here with local professor Albert Monkey, who thinks he has a special place that allows him to speak lies. Oh, he hello, Albert. Hello. Today, I'm going to be telling you about... Oh, nothing... Nothing useful? Yeah, I know, I know. No, 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 sir, that it is not very appreciated. I really would, sir, really would like to get it, sir. So, what I've heard is that the UMG is a extremely corrupt government and that recently the press has been very large on this junket of a missing $200 million that they say went to bad cause. I, I, do you know anything about this or no? Well, sir, uh, I, do I know anything about your small penis? No, I don't. Okay. Uh, what are you even talking about? Missing $200 million. And what this has done is this, this is not a good thing because what it, it, it really does is, especially you sitting here not telling me, is it tells, it tells, the, it tells, it tells, it tells, tells the, uh, the, the, the monkey population that you don't care and you're just trying to hide from them. Now, can you please tell me where these two hundred million dollars are? No, sir, I can't. Okay, I can't. Okay, I, I, I can't tell you where it is. Well, see, that is the problem because why should we be trusting our government if the government doesn't even trust us to tell us anything about what they do? Do, do you see the dilemma here? Now, what I'm saying basically is that the government has shown a lot of untrust, especially with what's been going on with this human situation. See, I, I'm not a human rights activist, okay? I think that they deserve no rights. I agree with you on that. But as it as it occurs with monkeys, I think monkeys are a much superior race and we do deserve more rights. But it seems like to you people that we don't, okay? And uh, what are you saying? No, no, I, it's fine from my side. I don't know. Oh, sorry, sorry, uh, bye. Oh, man, that the connection is, is bad. Oh, sorry, it's disconnecting. Well, would you look at that? The academia of this country is letting it go and is finally trying to destroy us. So remember, do not listen to them. Do not listen to the lies. And with that, thank you for watching Monkey News.